Thank you to Poshmark for sponsoring today's video. Hello everyone, my name is Claudia. I'm from Greece and you're watching I for me. Is it good? Yummy, 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 yummy. I'm just so happy. Why? I feel like we're finally in the clear. Like winter's over, spring is here, it's sunny outside. We never get to see the sun in the winter. Yeah, I know. It's just like, I just want to go outside and enjoy the warmth. And since it's like winter here most of the year, it's like all I have is jeans sweatpants sweatshirts and a bunch of stuff that like just piled up over the years and it'd be good if we can like sell some of this stuff a couple weeks ago when i thought it was going to be spring before the snow came back again and then it wasn't spring it was still winter i put on instagram how excited i was to do spring cleaning i asked my followers what their favorite apps were to sell clothes. The overwhelming response was Poshmark. And so I'm super excited that we partnered up with Poshmark to do some spring cleaning of our own and sell some of our clothes in the app. I've never even worn this. I think I can part ways with this Calvin Klein dress. What do you think? Yeah, I think you can too, it's funny. Is there anything you won't wear? I have like a bunch of stuff that I have from like previous teams and stuff that I've been on that I can sell. And then I have like a bunch of Levi's that I can sell too, so. This Nike Patriots uh, sweatshirt when I was with the team that I can sell because I'm not gonna wear this anymore. I got these, these are Nike too. My rookie year when I was with the Dolphins and I'm pretty sure I'm never gonna wear these again. Might as well uh, sell these too. And I have all these pants all these jeans that I do not wear ever. So I might as well get some of these Levi's too. Like I've never even worn these jeans before. They still have the tag on them. Do you think it's time to get rid of this Miami Dolphins tag? What do you think? I don't know. It's probably time. Ah. Make sure you share your closet handles in the comment section. Um, but I think we have a pretty good start on our Poshmark closet. What do you think? No, I think so too. Now that I put this bad boy in our closet, I gotta take pictures of the rest of this stuff and put it in our closet as well. Charlotte took some pictures and put some of her stuff in our, in our closet. Make sure if you wanna shop, hit the link in the description to download the Poshmark app for free where you can shop and get some, uh, some good stuff. Are you excited about selling some stuff that we have for a while? Yeah, but I get like attached to my clothes, so it's also kind of sad. I think it's safe to say that I'm somewhat kind of becoming like a Minnesotan. Because let me tell you something about Minnesotans. Soon as the sun cracks out after eight months of winter, everybody's outside running and tank tops. And it's like they had never seen the sun in their entire life. And I'm a prime example of that. Since I got back from uh, Tampa, you know, the weather has changed, obviously. And I've been going, me and Maddie, <laughs> me and Maddie have been going on these walks um, where I can kind of get out and get into the sun and kind of clear my mind. And one of the things I do in my quiet time in the morning is, is if I can't focus, uh, you know, I go on these walks and I listen to audio books or I listen to a podcast or I listen to something to kind of uh, feed my spirit um, to, try, to try to get clarity on, you know, me making this decision uh, here soon, whether to, you know, play football or not play football and trying to go in another direction. 
and uh, really see, um, you know, just where my heart is at. One of the books that I'm listening to right now is called How Life Imitates Chess. And I don't know if a lot of you guys notice that I'm a big chess player. Uh, I'm not a great chess player yet, but I do play chess. Chess is a game of patience. You probably wouldn't believe it, but like your adrenaline rushes when you play because every move that you make in chess really matters. You don't want to make a move too fast. You don't want to think about a move too long. But you have to be decisive and confident in whatever move that you make. And another thing that I do um, is what I call seeking godly counsel. And to me, that's reaching out to people who I trust with the thoughts that I have going on in my head. And I feel like that's something that's important because you gotta have people in your circle that you trust because making decisions like this is uh, hard for anybody when you are changing lives. And I'm at a point in my life where I had to make a move and I'm sitting and I'm looking at the board and I'm observing the game. And this is where I feel like God is, you know, feeding my spirit to kind of be still, to really seek information and seek knowledge and seek clarity before I make this move. You know, life can be complicated sometimes and you have to make these decisions and it's best not to rush these decisions. What do you want? You want this? Want, want my water? Want my water? Here, here you go. There you go. You gotta give them whatever works sometimes. <laughs> so yeah, that's something that I do and then I leave uh, with these walks when my partner here uh, has had enough. But. The last thing I do before I go home is Charlotte loves caribou coffee. So I always get her a coffee on my way back home after the morning talk, morning thought, whatever you want to call it. And yeah, so. Y'all done? Y'all done? Look, buddy, the weather's changing. Change is coming. Good things are happening. The world is coming. Baby shark, do 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 do. Baby shark, do 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 do. Baby shark, do 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 do. Baby shark, grandpa shark.